Okay, Blake interview, take one, AC Mark. Well, I, you know, I wish I could sit here and tell you that I know exactly, uh, you know, what the voice, uh, the television show is going to be about. I'm not really sure why the voice has lasted as, as long as it has. Uh, I know we're going to be sitting in these big chairs and our back is going to be to, you know, the performer. Uh, and we all have to decide, if, just based solely on this voice, uh, if we think this person can be a star. People just never get tired of this show. They, they love the idea, they love the fact that, uh, you know, we're, we're all about talent here and, and not uh, any of the other bull crap that comes along with, with the music industry. This is, this is talent first. And I love that about this show because uh, it's, it has to start with a great voice. This show has a lot of integrity and, and we really do work hard at, at trying to find the best singers we can find and, and then uh, try to help them as much as we can. I've never really done anything like this before. All I can really do is think back to uh, people that were mentors of mine along the way and, and the things that they did to help me uh, not become the artist that they wanted me to be but become the, the, the best that I can be and whatever that might be is different for everybody. This is a show that there will never be another one like it. And this opportunity is never going to come along again, uh, for, you know, to, to be able to coach other artists and, and, and work with them and, and try to pass along some of these, uh, you know, pitfalls that, that, and mistakes that I've made along the way and try to pass those lessons on to, to these artists so they don't make the same mistakes I did. And I hope that I can find out uh, with each individual, you know, artist that I'm going to be working with you know, what that one thing is that, that's special about them that we can bring out more and focus on and, and make these people, you know, not just singers, but unique artists. I think this is going to be loads of fun because uh, there's no drama. This is a fun, this is going to be a fun show that's about finding out who is the best vocalist in this group of people. When it comes to me, the other coaches uh, should watch their, their backs because, listen, I, you know, I'm the guy that came here to win. Not for publicity, not for money, came here to win. Well, if there's ever, if there's a situation, and I'm sure there will be, uh, where we all pick, you know, the same contestant for our team, uh, my angle uh, is going to be, you know, in order to get that person to choose me as their coach, uh, is to lie. There's a long history of, of coaches who join the voice and, and they win the first season they join the voice. I mean, Kelly did it, John Legend did it, the list goes on and on and then Nick Jonas comes along and completely fumbles on the play and, and he got beat. I mean, he got beat by me, but he still got beat. I mean, I guess when you, when you say it that way, who would have expected him to be, beat me? I mean, this is the entertainment industry. It's slimy. Well, I mean, I've had people along the way that have, you know, done great things for me. I've had people, uh, you know, suggest things to me that really screwed me up along the way, too, you know. I mean, I had a, I had a record producer one time suggest to me that uh, maybe I should start drinking more whiskey and smoking cigarettes uh, because it would help develop, you know, the bottom end uh, from my vocals, you know. I tried that for a while and, and uh, you know, woke up feeling like crap and, you know, was coughing all the time and realized that was a waste of you know six months of my life. I think it's just been a satisfying experience for me because uh, you know you learn a lot when you when you're in the music industry. As long as I've been in the music industry, 20 years now, as far as having hits on the radio and, and uh, touring, you find somebody who who can see down the road and, and they have the same similar vision uh, that you do for yourself, and and uh, that's that's what's hard to figure out. And you know you learn a lot, and most of that stuff you would you would end up just taking to the grave with you because there's not a lot of people out there that you can that can use the information that you've gathered over the years. And and uh, but the fact that we're working with artists and we're actually coaching them and trying to to help them not make the same mistakes that we made along the way, it's cool to have that outlet. That was the hardest thing for me to figure out as an artist is. Yeah, I love music and I love to sing and I can play guitar and do these things. But who, what do I want to say? Who do I want to be, you know? And, and uh, for me, I didn't start figuring that out until, you know, maybe five or six years ago, you know, well into my career. But, uh, you know, when you're 
in your mid 20s you, you still don't know who you are as a person much less an artist you know but you have to I think have some sort of indication of that at the end of the day it still is what it's what it started out to be which is a show that is about talent first and that's really cool I don't have to worry about what somebody looks like or the way they dress or whatever might be holding them back because if they're a great singer first they're already going to make it onto the show and then we'll, we can take the steps after that. Uh, there's been a lot of coach changes over the years and, and people coming in and out and, and, and obviously uh, Carson and I are the last two standing around here as far as who you see on this side of the camera. Uh, but uh, you know there's been a lot of rule changes. We've tried to keep it interesting as, as, as much as we can without losing uh, the integrity of the show. The voice gets back to what's important about music. It gets down to a great singer, you know, and it doesn't start with, oh, this person was, was in a movie, and uh, we think, you know, because it, 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 they like country music, we're gonna make a country album on them, and, and next thing you know, boom, it blows up, and, and it is a hit, you know, and it does sound good, and I go buy it. It's nice to know that what we're gonna be doing here is finding somebody with the bare bones talent just they were born a great singer they deserve to be recognized for that but it all starts from the right place which is a great singer <laughs>